I challenge each person in here, whether you are an elected official, an educator, a student, to become an ambassador for higher education, an ambassador. I don't know a family that's been fortunate to educate one or two of its kids who didn't want the others to get higher education. Two-year degrees, four-year degrees, post-secondary education, post-second jobs for the future talks about that. Four-year college is not for everybody. Let me be honest about that. A lot of people want something else first. They may want a certificate program. They may want an AA. You've got plenty of jobs. But post-secondary opportunities with a continuum, with more and more getting that first and wanting to go on and get more. But think about it. When we say, oh, people don't have confidence, we don't know people who get educated who don't want their kids to get educated or their spouses to become educated. We know the value, not just in terms of getting a job, but in terms of being a good thinker in terms of being able to separate what is truth from what may be on the other side of truth, right? And to have that balance to be able to understand how we learn how to listen to different perspectives and to work towards the common ground, but to, to make sure what we are following is the truth. I mean, of all the things I can say about higher education, it is that we know evidence matters, experts matter. And so we must all be the people to speak that truth but we have to do it in a way that does not sound condescending. People often think of scientists or mathematicians or people college educated as thinking they're better than other people. Only a third of Americans today have a four-year degree, and another certain percentage would have two years. But still, you're talking about under half of American population. So most people in America, most families have never had someone graduate. And as a result, they may not trust. It's up to us to speak the language of just being a decent human being and to let people know you can do this. This is what I love about USD when you talk about access, affordability, success, mm -hmm. and a job. Mm -hmm. You know, We must all speak that language to respect people who've not been as blessed as we are. 